Hey, hello everyone. In this tutorial, we will learn how to create the switch button in Android Kotlin. So as you can see, we are here having a switch button with the sun in the switch button and with some clouds. When we click on this switch button, it turns off and so our sun changes into moon and it shows some star as well as background has been changed to night and when we switch it on, it again changes to sun with some clouds and background is so attractive as you can see. So this type of animation we will create in our this tutorial. So, so head back to Android Studio. Yes, and simple project which I had created for our Daynet animation. As you can see, this is our Kotlin file, main file, and this is our XML file, uh, which is of empty activity. Currently, we don't need this text view, so I'm removing it and change the layout to recite. Uh, sorry. Uh, to relative layout now go to layout file and here's our main xml file and uh, now to do our dynet animation we need to add some libraries to our project so let's do that go to build.redit file and go to chrome now as you can see here's a library name as mafa dynet switch so <coughs> we will use this uh, library to do our dynet animation as you can see here it has been shown here but uh, this project is on github uh, in java language but uh, i am showing you tutorial in uh, android kotlin language so let's add this dependencies to our uh, project copy this dependency and paste it here as you can see it is i had pasted it here and then go and uh, copy this Marvin jetpack file copy it and paste it our build.url file in all projects paste it here so i think uh, we had added dependencies to our project now think now our project uh, it will download all the packages of that dependencies it may take some time wait until it uh, completes as you can see all the dependencies have been added and it has been synced successfully so now close all these gradient files and go to our xml file now here we need to add switch to our uh, project so here copy this code then add switch you can also type it but uh, i'm copying to save time as you can see uh, the switch has been added to our project now let's align it at the center center vertical becomes 2 center horizontal becomes 2 now it is at the center uh, but I don't need this uh, action menu so I am removing it go to styles and uh, make it no action bar and also oh, okay it's up open now as you can see action bar has been removed now let's once run the program and see what output it gives Uh, as you can see our uh, uh, switch button has been added to our project and there is no action bar at the top and when we off this switch button it changes to main uh, moon and when we on it changes to sun so now let's perform some listener on this switch button go to main file and as you can see your id of our uh, switch button is day night switch let's also give id to our relative layout let's give it layout now go to main file now let's uh, perform listener on now dynet switch dot wait listener now here we need to create a variable uh, which will return the value uh, let's give it name as uh, uh, is night and let's create a lambda function now if condition we will use if is night is true 
at that time show the toast message that night okay good night we will uh, toast messages good night it seems must be realistic and then we will print the toast message toast dot length dot and dot show method uh, same thing we will do with else condition we will print the toast method else it will print the toast method good morning right now let's do something more with that uh, let's change the background color if our uh, switch button is off which means uh, it is uh, night is going on at that time it will change our layout uh, dot set background resource to we will set background color set background color color dot pass color here we need to pass the x codes of our color which is uh, I'll give, you can give any color but I will give it as P and uh, pass the same for mornings change the background color to Okay, over well, here our hex value is wrong. It must be six digit. I have type seven digit. Now let's run the program and now it will work fine. When we switch off our switch button, at that time background color changes to different and it shows toast message. When we switch on our switch button, background color has been changed to blue and it shows toast message as good morning. Now let's change the background image of our uh, layout. Uh, for that we need to add some images to our uh, drawable folders. So I have downloaded here some images, just copy them and uh, sorry for that. Uh, press it to our drawable folder uh, here. As you can see our images has been added to our project uh, and let's change the background uh, resource of our layout dot background resource what's the r dot driver dot uh, now it's night right so it must be dark and do it change for morning copy this code and paste it here and just change the name of the image dark becomes big like now okay uh, before that we need to also change the colors uh, here so add we must pass this x value here copy this and pass it to color let's change the color of our header title so that it will be looked fine now let's run the program Now as you can see here our uh, color has been changed to blue because we had changed that hex value and when we off our uh, switch button at that time background image has been changed and it uh, seems to be more attractive uh, and when we switch it on uh, it shows this attractive image so I think uh, this is the I love this animation actually the cool uh, animation uh, you can use it when you are creating uh, any app and you want uh, the two things in our uh, in your app at that time you can create use this switch button and use this uh, type of stuff to change your theme as per user needs so it uh, seems to be attractive for your application so thanks for watching